Today I'm doing a 101 on the Encircled with Nature dies. Today is the launch of the new online exclusives. These are the dies. It coordinates with the stamp set called Encircled in Nature. Stamps are photopolymer. It's not true to size. It's been shrunk, so that's the actual size of the image. And this is much smaller, so it will fit on the front cover of the box. It's a big set because it has two sheets of dies. This die cuts out the berries and the stems of the wreath and I've cut all these in basic white and gone over the stems with a stamping blend in Pretty Peacock and then the berries in Petal Pink. In fact my top tip is that you cut them all out in basic white cardstock and then you can go over it with a stamping blend. So that one cuts that and this cuts out the pines. Um, it's one die but it will cut two separately and one curves to the left and the other curves to the right. And you have a group of pine trees, five of them, and a group of three smaller ones. Now this stamp you can see has a gap and the gap is so that you can place these two bits of the die with the uh, pieces that jut out in a semicircular and you place it along here where the gap is and line it up put tear and tape on here in order to keep the die together but you can see it better this way so you put the half moon shapes where the gap is and this will naturally fall into place where the twigs are and I've put low tack tape all over it to keep the shape I've also marked my stamp with two dots to show me where the gap is so that when you place it on a block to stamp you want the two points facing the same direction so I always have it facing south and that way I can remember it then when you come to stamping and die cutting I forgot to record ink it up and stamp this is facing south so there's your gap then you can place, let's take that all off, then you can place that on the inside first, okay, it fits around the inner circle, want to make sure that's secure, and place this one opposite that one, and you won't have any problems lining it up. Cut it on your machine and you come up with a perfect one like this. This die will cut out the stamped images of this floral piece here and you can colour it with stamping blends. These don't actually fit the stamp here, it's too big. And so these are standalone dies and one faces to the left and the other faces to the right and I've cut them separately. This one will cut out the large stamped tree here. That will cut that out and these will cut the leaves out and these aren't a stamped image on here they're just blanks so I've die cut those and I've coloured them in to make them look like autumn leaves. So that's my 101 on the Encircled in Nature dies. Thanks for joining me today and I'll be back soon. Bye.